welcome to another vlog and today I'm back doing my world tour of London stadiums and I'm here we're kind of going behind the lines yeah I'm here to see England women versus the Netherlands we're here at Wembley thanks McDonald's
going to continue to Goal scorer of the Netherlands, number seven, Lynette Beristein.
substitution for England, leaving the through number three, Neve Charles. Substitution for Netherlands, leaving the field number 10, Daniela van der Donk. Replaced by number 12, Shanice van der Sander. Go on, Shan! wasn't it? it finished 3 2 to England. Um, wow. I That was the first international game I was ever at, and I've learned a lot about football and fans and whatever else tonight. Um, I think the women's game here in Great Britain has obviously 
benefited so so much from the Lionesses winning and doing really well in the World Cup and the Euros and everything like that um, but fans always expect them to win now and teams don't always win and when when the, the team went down 2-0 the whole arse dropped out of the, the, the stadium to be quite honest with you it was really there was a severe lack of atmosphere people were leaving people actually left at half time uh, there was a couple sitting beside me they left um, the Netherlands basically had control of the right side of the park um, all England were doing in the first half was uh, going up their right side um, coming down the left for, for the Netherlands uh, the side that Lucy Bronze plays on uh, to be honest I don't know if anyone else actually showed up in the first half and um, yeah whatever happened at half time they got a good old talking to it took 13 minutes afterwards to score the goal and then another 90 seconds later or something they scored the second goal that definitely helped the substitutions then definitely helped they looked so so much better uh, Russo and Ella Toon Ella Toon just that was a great strike and I mean come on Serena needs to look at who she's leaving on the bench who she's putting in the starting lineup yes everybody goes through injuries everybody has um, people out at different times but that starting lineup today did not work and the back line did not work and they need to have something else because we're being ripped apart down the right it was so easy I could have gone down the right hand side uh, the Dutch right hand side there tonight and um, another thing it was uh, pretty cool Two of my favourite players on the pitch tonight, uh, Lucy Bronze and Shan van der Sanden. Um, nice to see them uh, have a couple of tackles. There's some uh, nice little fans in the background. Um, and um, yeah, it was nice to see that happen. That doesn't happen too often. Um, seeing as Shan plays for Liverpool and Lucy plays for Barcelona. So at least one of the things I wanted to achieve this year has happened. Um, or this season, I got to see Lucy Bronze play. Um, I'm hoping still at some stage to go and see Barcelona. I don't know if it's going to happen this season. It may be next season when that happens. But um, I, Barcelona are an amazing team to, to play, so I really want to do that. Um, so yeah, what else did I find out about Wembley? Great experience here. Um, easy to get to even though it's high up there it is high up the seats are quite steep you have a great view great point uh, great viewpoint uh, and uh, the tickets they're up at that height were really affordable but again as I said people and I think it's probably because it's the England team and because people were used to them winning all the time um, I still prefer club football you just have players connecting better you just have a higher standards they, they know what people are thinking and going to do before it actually happens um, it's almost like when you see some of the, the quality of some of the players and when other players haven't played with them before or haven't played on the team or they don't make up or whatever you can see that it's like you almost have to spell it out and tell them where to go it's almost like that there is like complete pros and school kids playing together but um, yeah there you go um, really interesting evening England win 3-2 hope you enjoyed the blog blog vlog whatever we call these nowadays um, yeah first time in Wembley uh, at a football match um, it's like one degree or something now I'm freezing ready to go home ready to get under the duvet and yeah like subscribe and join me for the next one sure I think the next one I'm going to London City Lionesses and I'm also that's in the FA Cup and I'm also going to Tottenham and Arsenal that is in the Hotspur Stadium so join me for those and yeah have a good one talk to you soon